You ready? Your bag's there, Willowy. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. It's a very welcome back to our channel. It's a very exciting day, isn't it, Willow? Yeah. What's happening today? I don't get to today. It's Willow's first day of nursery. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. So we're nearly ready to go. Yeah. Yeah. Um, go zip your bag up then. That's it. So yeah, it's the first day of nursery. Um. And I just thought I'd vlog today, maybe do a bit of like a day in the life, obviously I don't know what I'm going to do with my day because she's gone for like six and a half hours, so yeah, it's all exciting, Willow goes to school. We're going to go outside now and take a picture, what have I done with the letterboard? Yeah, I've set the letterboard up, I wanted to get a nice picture of something that like we could do like every year, um, so yeah, that's that. Are we ready, we'll pop your coat on? Let's go. This side, that's it. This side. By the side. Stand up then. Don't pull any letters off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is that our O? That's an O, yeah. O? Yeah. Come on then. Okay, let's go. So she's all dropped off. Oh, she was so good, bless her. Um, I failed this morning, actually. I didn't really get time to say much before we left the house. <laughs> but yeah, I failed. I meant to go food shopping yesterday and just didn't, because I thought, oh, I'll do it when I've dropped her at preschool in the morning. Uh, dropped her at nursery. Um, and we'd run out of cheese on Saturday night. So I had no cheese for a cheese sandwich, obviously, because she's having to take her lunch now. Um, and there's absolutely nothing else she would have on the sandwich. So <laughs> for God's sake. It's a good job that mum and dad live next door because I had to ring dad at like quarter to eight this morning to <laughs> borrow a block of cheese. Um, so yeah, mum failed number one on her first day of nursery great start <laughs> but yeah she's gone in really good she wrote her name she gave me a kiss and absolutely fine like not a single tear but then I suppose like she has been doing it for a year like she's been going to preschool and she loves that and yeah so I'm now going to go to the garden center and see if I can get a plant to sit in the gap in our fireplace um I say fireplace it's not actually a fire in it <laughs> TV, it's got TV in it. Um, but yeah, there's little like shelves built into the brick and they just look, it just looks really bare. Like I said about it on Instagram the other day. It's so big. Um, so I just want like a little plant that's gonna like hang down. Um, just to give it a bit of a life. Right, I'm here at Dobby's. Um, I'm hoping for either a string of hearts or a string of pearls um but i'm not hopeful let's go in and have a look so i really like the leaves on this one look they're like pink how nice is that hopefully not today because it's 24.99 so i'm gonna just a little bit cheaper no luck in dobbies whatsoever I did find a nice one with like pink leaves that I showed you. I'm just gonna have a look online, I think. Um, I've just popped it on Instagram whether anyone knows where's good to shop online for plants. Obviously I don't wanna get it get it from anywhere and it come and it be rotten or, do you know what I mean? So I'd rather get a decent one um, from somewhere. And then yeah, hopefully that'll be here in a couple of days. I just really wanted one today. I wanted to find it. I might have a look in Aldi because they do some nice plants when they have them in. Um, and I know, like, I've got Pup to B&M as well, probably. They sometimes have plants in. I have a look, but obviously I'm not, I'm not holding out any hope. <laughs>
we're back. Well, I'm back. Oh my god. <laughs> it took way longer than it needed to. All the tills crashed in Aldi, so I must have literally been stood by like the till for about 15 minutes, just waiting for them to reload. It's not an issue, like, people were kicking off, but it's one of them, isn't it? Technology. I'm a bit of a granny when it comes to food shopping and I have to put it on a chair because I just can't be bothered to bend down. Oh, it's very bright. Um, brought myself some flowers. Sort them out in a minute. Uh, so we're just gonna sort it all. Also replace mom and dad's cheese. That I pinched this morning. Um, so all the fridge and freezer stuff goes on this work here just because it's easier. It's just covered in apps. This kitchen just gets so messy. There we go, we've got a nice full fridge for the week. Um, so, oh no, I forgot to put this milk in. <laughs> Where on earth am I gonna put that? Hang on, squeezed it in the bottom there. I've had to squeeze the meatballs up here, but we're having them for dinner tonight anyway, so yeah. Um, I'll talk you through the meals for the week quickly, if I can find the shopping list. Oh yeah, I put it away. Excuse the notepad, Willow um, scribbled on it a while ago. So I basically make a list of like the days of the week and meals. So obviously spag bowl tonight, chicken wraps tomorrow, which I'm going to try and make the, like do the breaded chicken myself, just so it's a bit healthier. Wednesdays we're having pizza because I'm working late. I'm working until quarter past six, I think. So I like to have a quick dinner that night. Uh, cheeseburger pasta, which is a recipe from the Slimming Eats website, I think it is. Friday I've put treat night, because Willow will have done her first full week in nursery and preschool. So we'll have, I'll see what she wants, probably a McDonald's. Um, Saturday, sausage and mash. Then Sunday, a roast. We normally go to mum and dad's for a roast dinner. Dad cooks it every week. So what I do then is... Um, Obviously, I've squirreled it all out here anyway. But so, like, I'll go through each thing and then down this side, I'll write what I need for them. So, like, mince meat, pasta, tomato puree, all that sort of stuff for like each thing. So, that's like meals there. And I find that because a lot of stuff now is just sort of in the cupboards, I don't end up having to buy a lot. Um, and then down this side is just stuff that we sort of have to buy every week. Do you know, like Worcestershire sauce, I can see that. Mayo, um, dog food, cat food, milk, squash, like all stuff like that. Um, yeah, so that's how I like to do it. And it works. We spend about £40 on average every week. It sort of goes up and down slightly, but we never spend like silly money. So I am now going to nip upstairs and film a video. Um, I want to film my goals for 2020. It's a week late, we're in the middle of January now, but uh, yeah, it is what it is. Um, obviously, like I had last week off, but Willow was here pretty much all week, so I just thought I'm just gonna leave it till Monday when she's not here. I can sit down properly and crack on with it. And then I'm just gonna have a good tidy up really. Like the whole house is just, <laughs> it always is never tidy um but i'm just gonna yeah i'm just gonna spend the afternoon having a good tidy up and then at least then when willow comes home i can just 
play with her and relax or do whatever she wants to do instead of being distracted by like cleaning and jobs and things so yeah so i've just finished filming my goals video and i'm gonna have some lunch it doesn't look too appetizing but it is actually really nice this is the enchilada lasagna that i made um, the other night um i'm on my phone at the minute because the camera battery was dying so i'm just gonna film on this for a bit while that charges um gonna make some lunch watch a youtube video and then i really need to hoover because the dog is starting to molt again and i hate it So I'm going to catch up on a bit of Jess while I eat my lunch. It looks disgusting, but it's actually really good. Excuse the frozen merchandise. <laughs> we always said I was never going to be one of their moms that had a house full of Disney princess stuff. But here we are. <laughs> oh, look, an Anna doll. She looks like she's had her finger in a plug. Anyway. <laughs> I'm going to have a good couple of hours now, just sort of cracking on with my to-do list, get some housework done. So I'll probably put you just on a time lapse. I'm just going to hoover and do some washing and stuff. So it's nothing overly exciting. <laughs> but here we go. I've just put some washing on. Um, I think I'm gonna go back in the living room and while Willow's not here, just hoover off the sofa cushions. Um, because when she's here, she always thinks it's a game. And it can be quite challenging. So yeah, I just need to remove all the bits because I just kind of chucked everything on the sofas whilst I was hoovering. So I need to chuck everything off and just give them a quick hoover. Although I feel like I only did it the other week, but I'm gonna do it again anyway.
There we go. Two perfectly assembled dots. Because I like this for probably half an hour until Willow gets home. Quick spray this and uh, yeah, I'll just leave it then to dry while I'm not here. There's like hardly anything left in here, so I'm not feeling hopeful. <laughs> Willow's home! Oh. <laughs> there she is! <laughs> Have you had a lovely first day? She's not really telling me a lot. She just says she doesn't know. So I don't know what she's done. What she's played with. Who she's played with. Would you like some telly on? No, yeah. Mm, yes or no? Yeah, no, no, yes and no. Hmm. Yes and no. Alright then. The weather is vile. I swear to God, we hit the school run time and it just hammered it down. The wind is vicious and yeah, we're done for the night now, aren't we? We're staying inside now. I think so. We'll have some dinner. Mommy needs a shower tonight. I need the night and two bottles of bath. No, you have a bath tomorrow. She had a bath last night, remember? Yeah. Mind you, don't slip on that scooter. So, tell everybody what you've done at school today. Mm, I don't know. She doesn't know. I certainly don't know. <laughs> Jeez. What have you chosen to watch instead, Miss Willow? Uh, the Big Friendly Giant. We're watching The Big Friendly Giant. Here we go. That's London. So the first in London. The Queen lives in London. And the Dirty Rascals. And the Dirty Rascals? <laughs> yeah. They live in London too. Yeah. Go on and do the E line on a dot. Line on a dot, this one. That's it. And then two Liz. Two, this one. That's it. Another one. You've got two Liz and then an O. Oh. Which one's an O? Oh. Oh, not. No, an O. Oh. An O. Oh. O? Oh. Where's the O? Oh? Where is it? O. Oh. O. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's a round one, remember? And this one. I don't want to see it. A round one? Oh, I don't want to see the round. Oh, there it is. There it is. And I then another W. There it is. Well done. Getting good at that, aren't you? Mm hmm. Clever girl. So she really learnt to do a name at Christmas when we were writing Christmas cards for preschool. I put on Instagram so I wasn't sure how to go about it and then in the end I wrote the names of the children and then she just wrote her name, like her name in all the cards and it, it really worked. Like she, she can write her own name now. It's obviously a bit squiggly but she's cracked it so which I, I mean I don't know if that's good or like if that's quite clever or what but not, I'm impressed <laughs> Where 
Ja, det är sagt. Nej. Nej, för vad kan du säga om det här dagens skola? No way. Så du har sett Brave? Mm, I'll put football on. I say a corner. Yeah. I wonder. Did you have a good day at school, Sash? Huh? I was gonna ask her all about her day and give her the biggest kiss and cuddle in the whole wide world. I was, but looks like it's just me finish. I'll put the football on, I think. Hmm. Me. Is she hiding again? Where's she gone? She gone. Neither. And now I could see her. Look at it. Well, you could hear a doll. <laughs> Need to spin for my peas. Do you want to spin for your peas? Yeah, and for my peas. 